Wait. Okay, can you hear me? Cool. Cool, cool. Um, <clears throat> let's see if any, uh, anybody shows up here. I can't, I don't know that I can see if people are showing up. I can't see anything, but very cool. Um, everybody, if you're here, um, please make sure to type in, hey, Jordan, I love Tupperware in the comments, and I will get y'all entered into the drawing at the end of this. So just say, hey, Jordan, I love Tupperware in the comments. Um, so far, I can't tell who, if anybody is in here and nobody has commented yet. So we will just wait a little bit. Oh. Hi, Darren, make sure to say, hey, Jordan, I love Tupperware, and we'll get you entered into a drawing at the end of this, and maybe you'll win some goodies. Um, I'll just hold this up for now, if I can, until everybody gets in here. Uh, Darren, again, thank you. Oh, Michael's on. Michael, you're in the drawing. Darren, you're not in the drawing. I just want you to be aware of that. There's me welcoming all my Tupperware lovers. Tom, that's great to see. Holly, you used a hashtag, so that's even better. Mallory, you gotta say, hey, Jordan, I love Tupperware. You gotta say the, you gotta type in the full word, Nick. <laughs> um, I think we got enough people here. Uh, how's everyone doing? Happy uh, Passover and Easter weekend, everybody. Um, Darren, I don't see that your comment was edited. It still just says, hey, for me. So I'm not quite sure what to, what to say about that. But um, again, a very happy uh, holiday weekend. I, I hope everyone is staying safe and having a great time inside with your family and friends. Um, uh, Perfect. Jerry's in. Brady's in. Henry. Wow, we're filling up. We're filling up fast, and this is fantastic. So, hey, guys, you know, let's, before we all get started and start talking about Tupperware, I want to get us all excited, and I want to get the energy up. So, uh, what I want you guys to do is, if you're watching right now, I want you to just stand up. Um, no, Jerry, it's fine. You can say hi. Uh, it's totally fine. Um, so, I want you guys to stand up. I want you to put on a, a quick tune or two, and I want you to just kind of shake, shake it out. I want to get the energy up because we're going to be talking about Tupperware. Okay, so let's just take a moment, and I can't play a song or else my stream will go dead. Um, so I'm going to put some headphones on real quick and just dance it out because I'm pretty low energy right now. And I want to get that up because I'm talking about something I love, and that's Tupperware. So um, let's give it about five seconds or so, and we're just going to play a quick song and uh, start dancing. Okay, here we go. So we're just gonna shake it out. Shake out the arms first. That's most important. And then you wanna shake out your, your legs a little bit. And now that'll keep everything loose. And then we can talk about what we wanna talk about. So I'm feeling great. I don't know about you all, but I'm feeling good now. Whew. And I am ready to do this. So first of all, for anyone who is not aware of who I am, my name is Jordan Eskenazi. Um, I am a late night talk show host and a Tupperware consultant. So um, uh, we're gonna be talking about Tupperware, but I have to get this out of the way first. Um, my late night show, Everything's Fine Tonight Live with Jordan is coming back next Saturday at 8 p.m. We're gonna be streaming live on Facebook. So make sure to follow Everything's Fine Tonight Live on Facebook and uh, it's gonna be great. Um, but let's get to what you guys are all here for, huh? Let's get to Tupperware. So. I have a lot of Tupperware here next to me. Wow, I'm, whew, I'm a little winded from that dance. Um, I haven't really done a lot of uh, 
uh, movement in about a month. Uh, but everything's good. Um, hey, by the way, if everyone, uh, if anyone has joined after this started, make sure to say, hey, Jordan, I love Tupperware in the comments, and you'll be entered in a drawing at the end to win some Tupperware. Um, so we're going to get this rolling here in just a moment. And uh, oh, by just a moment, I mean right now. So let's talk Tupperware. So people are always like, Jordan, what's Tupperware all about? Why do I even need I'm back. <laughs> oh boy. Um, that was scary for a second. Um, so we're going to talk about Tupperware here. And again, people are like, what's the deal with Tupperware? Um, Tupperware is really important, especially nowadays um, in our current climate, because what happens is people will go out to the restaurant, get some food, and then they won't finish their meal and they want to save the food for maybe tomorrow or the next day or something like that so that they don't have to go to the store again or they don't have to go to a restaurant again or whatever. So that's when Tupperware really comes in handy. So I have a lot of, a lot of different Tupperware here. Um, I have smaller bowls, um, bigger bowls, and, but not only that, and also you can see these are plastic and plastic is really good uh, for uh, the environment. Uh, but I also have some glass Tupperware. Now people are always like, what Tupperware is plastic? There's no such thing as glass Tupperware. Well, guess what? <laughs> there is. So I've got all sorts of stuff. I got glass, I got plastic. I even got these uh, beautiful uh, black ones here. They're plastic. They look like little takeout entree Tupperwares, but uh, they're really, really come in handy. And it contains four cups. So you can put four cups of food or liquid in there. Um, it's all very exciting. Um, something I need to tell you real quick is that all of these bowls on their own cost $49.99 each. For just for this right here, this is $49.99. This $49.99. This $49.99. But if you order all of it together, guess what? It's 30 bucks. So that's kind of the deals that I'm running with today with you guys. So um, again, make sure to say, hey Jordan, I love Tupperware. Um, in I do have lids. Thanks. That's a great Mallory, that's a great question. I do have lids. Um, all sorts of lids. Look at this. We got lids here. And here's something people don't think about when it comes to lids. Give me just a second. I want to show you what I can do with a lid. So say, say for whatever reason you're missing a bowl, right? You just got a lid. Look what I can do. I've got some chips, some garden. Okay. First of all, hold on. Now this is cute. I just want you to see the name of this, of these chips. Garden of Eaton. <laughs> Can you see that? Garden of Eaton. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It gets me every time. It's the plan Garden of Eaton. But anyways, what I like to do is I'm going to pour some chips on a lid. Look at this. You can use the lid as a bowl or a plate even if you like. So that's just another cool perk of uh, lids. Um, folks, I, I want to make this a little fun for us. I do have some poll questions and some other questions. And let's try and get a poll going here. Um, let's see how I can. This is a fun little trivia question. Um, and let's see how many people get it right. Um, how many years ago was Tupperware invented? Make sure not to Google the answer. Um, and I can see how many people say an answer. I don't think anyone has said anything so far. Oh, somebody got it wrong. Um, okay, let's look at the comments. I'm so sorry I've been in presentation mode and haven't been addressing the comments. I do have lids. John can't afford that. Holly, uh, there's no scum in any of these. I'm not sure what you're talking about. Um, uh, perfect. Austin, you're in the drawing. Liam never has leftovers. What else do I use? Okay, yeah, you know, Liam, that's a great question. Something that I like to do with Tupperware is see this bowl right here? You can take a bowl like so, and you can wear it as a hat. 
It's a cool fashion statement that a lot of people don't. Oh, there it is. Sorry, I'm a little out of frame. <laughs> people don't realize you can wear bowls on your head. Um, what a lot of people don't know is that bowler hats, that's named after Tupperware. Uh, bowls. Um, does the lid match the mouth of the bowl? It does. So, uh, look at this. Check that out. It closes perfectly. Just like that. So everything, all the lids match, everything's good. Now let's take a look at our poll question uh, that I posted. It looks like three people got it right. It is 74 years old. Can you believe it? Tupperware is 74 years old. That's probably one of the greatest um, inventions I've, I'm aware of, to be honest with you. Um, let's do another fun question. Um, I'm gonna publish this one here. Which of the following can you put in Tupperware. Now keep in mind, Tupperware can be plastic or glass. So it's, you, you can do anything. Oh, okay, we're already getting some answers in. I wish I could see who answered what, but it just shows me a blue check mark next to the answers. But gosh, I'm having a lot of fun. I don't know about y'all. Um, okay, some people are getting it. Wow, a lot of people so far are getting it right. And that's really exciting to see. It looks like a lot of people love Tupperware. Um, Ooh, it's getting good. Uh, Holly, you drink water out of bowls. That's very smart. You know, you can save money on cups and mugs and glasses. Um, uh, you know what? I'm going to close. I think we're, we've all answered. So look at these results, guys. Who all got it right? Tell me who got it right. Emily, make sure to say, hey, Jordan, I love Tupperware in the comments, and I'll get you uh, in a poll. Uh, not a poll. I'm so sorry. A drawing at the end of the video to potentially win some goodies. So um, uh, please, please, please say, hey, Jordan, I love Tupperware in the comments. I'm not really seeing that many of them. Um, I really want you guys to win um, some stuff. What do you mean? Can you store Tupperware? Henry, check this out, my guy. Look at this bowl, little bowl, putting it in a bigger thing of Tupperware. Boom, look at that. You can put Tupperware in Tupperware. It's like Tupception. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, whew. sorry. I didn't mean to swear. Um, look, let's do another quick question here. Um, again, do not Google the answer, okay? I want you to use your gut and tell me who invented Tupperware. I'd love to see who's on the right track. I am sweating profusely right now. Um, uh, maybe need some water. <sighs> oh, yeah, I would, you know what, Emily, I would love to uh, come by and talk to you about Tupperware all day and uh, hopefully get you to buy some Tupperware. Um, it looks like a lot of people are getting this one. Ooh, a lot of people think, yeah, you know what, I'll let you work on that. I got some more examples of Tupperware. Um, oh. So look at this. Here's some other pieces of Tupperware. Now, this looks like what you get when you go to a restaurant. You go to like a Thai place and you're like, hey, give me some food to go or whatever. And they put it in this. And it really comes in handy because you can see through it and you can label the top. This is V for virgin, which is me. I'm a virgin. <laughs> Just kidding. I'm having some fun. Um, but I got some rice in here from a few days ago and it's still perfectly fresh, perfectly tasty and nice. So these are really great. Again, this is $39.99. But if you buy it together with all the rest, it's only $30. Um, this smaller one here, I've got some beans. Ooh, they've been in here for a while, but you can see they really still look fresh as ever. That's because the Tupperware technology keeps it fresh, keeps it tasty, and it keeps all the flavor inside. Um, so just another couple good examples. So it looks like, uh, wow, a lot of people thought Gary Tupperson invented it, but folks, Earl Tupper is the inventor of Tupperware. Can you believe it? He invented that over 70 years ago. He just, yeah, I don't know. I, I thought it was Earl Tupperware, uh, personally. Um, you are not wrong, Henry, you are not wrong. <laughs> um, dang, I had a bunch of fun questions, but now they've disappeared. Uh, but that's fine. Uh, let's just check in real quick, folks. Uh, be honest with this poll, please be honest. Uh, with this one. Are y'all having fun? Because I'm having fun. <laughs> a 
love to see. I'm waiting for some answers here. Nobody's up. Oh, yep. Okay. That's a good one. I forgot that this one has correct answers too. I mean, I feel like the last one should be right, but um, there's no wrong answer in this one. So even if it says you're wrong, you're right in my book. Um, so how many people here are, are, are thinking that, you know what, I think Tupperware sounds good to me and I'd like to purchase some Tupperware from you right now, J-Man. How many people just, you can type in the comments, I'm, I'm looking. You can just say, me, me, I want Tupper Tup. Me, me, I, please type in me, me, I want Tupper Tup. Please literally type in me, me, I want Tupper Tup in the comments. Please say me, me, I want Tupper Tup in the comments, type it in. Me, me, I want Tupper Tup. Nobody's typing it. Please, for the love of God, me, me, I want Tupper Tup. Nope, people are just doing emojis. How do you see the polls on a phone? I don't know. There we go, John wants it. Okay, thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you so much. Um, Brady, what can I do to, to get you over that fence? How can I make you more interested in the Tupper Tup? This is for for anybody, actually. I guess how how can I how can I get you guys more excited about some Tupper Tup? I wonder if there's a delay, and that's why these are all coming through now. And I was shouting at you guys when you were seeing another video. I only have about 135 dollars left in my savings, but I'm realizing it would be a good use of my savings to invest now since the ROI is so clear to me. I'm all but yeah. You know what, Emily? You are on the right track. You're in the right headspace. Um, Jordan, how smell proof are these products? If I theoretically put one, uh, whoops, I just tabbed somewhere else, put one of my luggage and went through a part of security. That's a, okay, so Justin, perfect question. How smell proof are the products? If you put it in your luggage, will airport security dogs smell inside of it? So that's why it's good to get bowls of different sizes, right? Because you can put a large bowl and then put whatever you want in the smaller bowl. Then you put a lid on top of the larger bowl. And then wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. No one can smell this. Not even a dog, not even a trained dog. So make sure to, that's why you gotta get multiple sizes of tupper, tuppy tup. Um, okay. All right, looks like we're all having fun. So I'm gonna show you all the results to that one. Does Tupperwell still turn red if you keep spaghetti in it? Joe, here's a tip. Here's a, t a hashtag Tupper tip. Make sure to type in hashtag Tupper tip in the comments if you enjoy this Tupper tip. Um, oh, I just burped. So here's what you got to do to avoid stains in your Tupperware. All right. First and foremost, you want to spray a light amount of cooking oil on the bottom of the bowl. Okay. Then you put the food in, then you microwave it. Then when you take it out of the microwave, there is no stain at all. I did it with... I did it with this one just the other day. Look how non-red, it's completely clear, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Hashtag Tupper Tip. Uh, ooh, a lot of, lot of people, a lot of comments here. Let's scroll up real quick. I'm sorry if I'm, if I'm not following through on everybody. Uh, uh, maybe I want Tupper Tup, perfect. Uh, do you have Tupper hats? Ian, you know what? I talked about this maybe before you got here, but check this out. This could be a hat. You could just wear this as a hat if you want. And it's perfect. It's beautiful. Um, there's some tups like bongos. I can do that a little later. If I put a dog inside the Tupperware, would my drug smell it? Uh, Emily, it sounds like you're just goofing. <laughs> Uh, are there single or multi-use tubs? Matt, um, these are all multi-use tubs. All of these. You can use it, you wash it, you can use it again. It's good for the Enviro. Mint. Uh, got a lot of hashtag cover tubs. Can you keep Blu-ray DVDs in your cover? You know what? I'm not sure that it is big enough. Uh, wait, what are these hashtag lies and hashtag wrong about? All right, hey, let's... Folks, here's my favorite question. Here's my favorite poll so far of the day. Let's see if you guys get this one right. I'm gonna try and keep this hat on all the, the rest of this stream.
By the way, please keep in mind, or, or I think I already mentioned this earlier, um, but something really important. Um, next week, Everything's Fine Tonight Live is returning. That's right. We're going to be on the internet on our Facebook page doing a live Facebook Live late night comedy show. Something y'all have never seen before. So please make sure to tune in. It's at eight o'clock next Saturday. Or, yeah, next Saturday. Um, Jerry, you can put Pizza Bank leftovers in there. You can put Pizza Hut leftovers in there. You can put bank stuff in there. Um, you can put whatever you want in there to be a TBH. <laughs> Let's see here. Beep, bop, boop. Uh, can I see the poll on my phone? Yeah, I'm so sorry, guys. I don't know that you can see polls on your phone. I'm, I'm really sorry about that. I don't, I don't, I'm kind of new to this. This is my first Tupperware party. So uh, I'll try and figure something out next time I do this. Uh, is Tupperware right for me? I just don't know if I can fully incorporate them into my kitchen life. Uh, Aaron, I don't know. Uh, why wouldn't it be for you? They're, they're very small. You can put them wherever you want. They don't take up a lot of space. You can put them in your fridge. You can put them in your, your chest of drawers. Is it chest of drawers or chest and drawers? Please comment in the comments and please uh, clear that up for me because I don't really know. Um, thanks, Sandy. She says I look great. Holly just says how, and I'm not sure what that is a thing. I don't know what her how is in regards to. Um, Y'all want to see the results to that poll question? Please type in yes, please in the comments, and then I'll show you guys the results. So just type in yes, please, and then I'll put, I'll click this button that says show results in video. So just make sure to type in yes, please. Waiting for a yes, please. Chest of drawers. Thanks, Jerry. Uh, Chester drawers. No, that's not right. Um, shut the hell up, Angie. Um, yes, please. Okay, perfect. Here are the results. Look at that. A lot of people got it right. Not quite sure about the five people that said glad. Uh, I think you're in the wrong uh, party. <laughs> you gotta go get get glad somewhere else, you asshole. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to swear. Oh. Uh, can the Tupperware float on water with food in it? Yeah, I, I don't see why not. I want to buy some effing tubs. Austin, you can buy some effing tubs, dude. Um, I just got to show you all the tubs. Like, this is some tubs. This is some tubs, too. Like I said before, each and every one of them separately is $35 each. But if you buy every piece of Tupperware that I've shown you today uh, together, it's $50. Um, Brady, why is your face bleeding? If I ever, if I use leftover Tallinn tea containers, I get ice cream and storage. Will you give me ice cream? I can talk to my, uh, uh, one of my other uh, uh, Tupperware representatives. I have a Tupperware liaison who's kind of in charge of me. Um, I can reach out to them and see what we can do about maybe getting you some ice cream. Um, I mean, if that'll get you to buy some Tup Tup. <laughs> um, Hey, Adrian, make sure to say, hey, Jordan, I love Tupperware in the comments, and uh, you'll get in, uh, draw. I'll enter you in the drawing at the end. Dang, Brady, I'm very sorry to hear that. You know, I, I, Tupperware could help uh, with your bleeding face. Um, I think I'm out of uh, poll questions, and uh, I don't have any other questions in here, so let's just quickly sell some more uh, Tup Tup. So who wants to buy this? Anyone want to buy this? Just comment in the comments below uh, that I would like to buy that, Jordan. Please, um, if you want to buy this one. Now, this is a uh, this is a Tupperware, a glass Tupperware uh, bowl. Um, very sturdy. It's very heavy too. Like if I hold it like this, you can see how it droops down like that. Um, it's very heavy, very sturdy. Um, and this is again, this is. Okay, uh, we're not, listen, we're not playing truth or dare, guys, okay? We're having a Tupperware party, okay? Unless the truth and or dare is about buying Tupperware, stop. <laughs> okay. Um, uh, look, this shit, this, you know, it's not Pyrex. People think it's Pyrex, but it's actually Tupperware. Um, and this shit is magic. <laughs> um, nope, does not say Pyrex. No, sure doesn't. It says Tupperware, see? Doesn't say Pyrex, it's not Pyrex. Stop saying it's Pyrex. Uh, it is Tuppy Tup. Um, 
Uh, what else? What else can I talk about uh, Tupperware here? Um, did you folks know that Tupperware, the plastic Tupperware containers are made of four or five pieces, types of plastic? That's why it's good for the environment. Pla people, here's something people get out of, uh, that, that people don't understand this. People think, people hear the word plastics and they're like, oh, no, it's horrible for the environment. We can't do plastic. Shut up. Plastic's good for you. You got to put stuff in plastic. It keeps food fresh. I love it. Also, look at this cute guy. You ever, here's a, here's maybe a personal question um, for people. Uh, Y'all ever, uh, Y'all ever eat salsa or dips or anything like that? Raise your hand if you do that. Uh, and you can raise your hand in front of your computer. I don't have to see it. I'll just assume that you're raising your hand. Looks like a lot of people are raising their hands. Look at this little cute Tupperware. So I use this one for salsa, other dips, bean dips, something like that. And then I could just dip my chip. Look at this. You dip your chip in here, you get a lot of salsa. Stale. Those chips are stale. Those are stale chips. That's gross. Very stale. <laughs> Sorry, I lost my hat. Um, <laughs> stale chips. Stale, you know what? Stale chips are gross. Um, oh boy. Oh. Um, yeah, so <laughs> let's check out these comments again. I dare you to make a hat again out of the tub. I already did, buddy. Um, if plastic is good for us, can we eat the Tupperware too? Sure. Uh, I don't say, I don't see why not. Um, I use Pyrex when I break on my crack cocaine. Yeah, you know what, John? That's the only time that Pyrex is good um, if you, you want to do drugs. But if you want to, like, be in <coughs> choking on the chip still. <coughs> Holy shit. Um, if you want to be serious about Tupperware, you got to get Tupperware, not Pyrex. <coughs> um, oh, God. Show us how durable the Tuppy Tuppy. Okay, yeah. Here's how strong Tupperware is. So this is Tupperware. And a lot of people are like, can it break? Like how, blah, 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 break? Check this out, I'm very, people know that I'm, look at this. I'm a strong, I'm strong. And now let me see here. Nope, it's perfect, look at that. Didn't break, perfectly fine. Very sturdy. Oh God, I just pulled something. Um, with the chips, yeah, so uh, that's a great point, Henry. Had I put these chips in a bowl instead of just kept it in the bag, by the way, again, for people who just joined and didn't see what I pulled these out earlier, these are called Garden of Eaton. <laughs> it's perfect, especially because Easter's tomorrow, you know, so Garden of Eaton. <laughs> I love it. Um, but yeah, had I kept these in a bowl instead of a bag, they'd be fresh as daisies. Um, can you stack hats? Yeah, check this out. Two lids. Boom. Um, can Tupperware store cocaine at room temp? I don't like plastic bags. I don't see why not. Um, I'm here for the couch sale. Wrong place. So sorry, Liam. Uh, tip top cover. Thank you. Can you do your business in tup if necessary? Yes. Uh, that's a real good point there, Tom. Um, cause we're in kind of uncharted territories when it comes to uh, everyday life. So if something weird happens where you maybe run out of toilet paper or run out of toilets, you can just do it in a Tupperware, uh, bowl, uh, if you'd like. Um, I think I have, do I have a, uh, where did it go? Dang. I thought I had a very big bowl, but it seems to be missing. Um, but it would be perfect for doing a one or a two if, if necessary. Um, Please put a shoe on your head. I don't have one near me. Where's the couch? I don't have it. Um, I wish I could boot Liam out of here. Um, Jenny wants to know if I become a distributor, uh, Distributor, will she get a cupcake caddy? Um, great, great question, Joe. Um, yes, she. we do offer cupcake caddies. I don't have any with me right now because we sold out recently, um, but they're on back, back order basically. But um, I love it and she'd love it too. Um, do barrel roll, I don't know how. She went ahead, I'm not going to you from my sister. Um, Okie doke. 
Flotation is important. Okay, here, I'll pour some water. Let's try this flotation thing that people are talking about. Pouring water in the bowl. Now let's see if it'll float my beans. Look at that. It's floating. So it floats perfectly. Wait, how do I? There it is. So it's floating very nicely. Um, keeps it very good. So like if you wanted to like um, temper some chocolate, right? And then you want to like put it in a ice bath to kind of cool it down. You can do it perfectly fine with Tuppy Tup. Um, where do I? Where can I put that? I don't want to spill water everywhere. I'll just put it over here. Oh, thanks, Ben. Uh, is the tub cake? No, it's cupcake, Caddy. Uh, it is not. Lazy Sudan is not a thing either. <laughs> oh, tight. Gold is all on board. Um, my yeah, Holly, uh, I will answer your question. Uh, Liam, I'm, I'm very sorry that someone told you this is a couch sale. This is not a couch sale. This is a tupper sale. Um, again, this is not Pyrex. People keep saying it's Pyrex. Um, I guess people think it says Pyrex on the bottom, but if you actually look closely enough, it says Tupperware. See right there? Tupperware. See that? <laughs> you see where it says Tupperware right there? Because I do. Feel free to snap a picture right now of me. Uh, so there's where it says Tupperware. And perfect. Um, uh, can you use Tupperware? Yeah, Emily, a great question. Again, you're the, the queen of great questions today. Um, I actually had a poll question earlier that said we could put food, um, crafts, odds and ends, anything you want in it. Um, uh, will it float with my gold reserve coins? Do you have a large plate size Tupperware for my commemorative collector's plates? I'm kind of confused. So why are you trying to float coins and, and plates in Tupperware? Um, I mean, you can. Don't get me wrong. You can use Tupperware for whatever you want. Oh, I haven't worn a tie in a minute. And uh, uh, there it is. Uh, take I take Tup to church and pray with it. Uh, sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Listen, you can take Tupperware anywhere you want. The only thing you have to do is purchase it from me. That's literally it. Um, that's all. Just buy it from this guy right here. Oh, me. <laughs> I'm just put it was. Um, but you can just buy it from me and bing, bang, boom. You're in business. Um, be prepared. Yeah, it doesn't hurt to be prepared, um, especially with Tupperware. So folks, I've been doing this for about 33 minutes now. I'm probably gonna wrap up here shortly. Do I have, are there any questions uh, real quick before we go? Maybe about how to purchase this stuff or maybe how to watch Everything's Fine Tonight live next Saturday at 8 p.m. on Facebook Live. Any questions about anything like that? Because I'd love to answer them before I go. Um, this has really been a joy um, and a blessing. Um, what's a question you wish more people asked about Tupperware? Wow, that is, a great question. Um, I guess I wish people asked me why I love Tupperware, but nobody has asked me that. Check this out. Tub. Oof. See, there you go. How do I purchase your Tupperware? You just got to go to Tupperware.com backslash Jordan Eskenazi and selling Tupperware.htm and you're in my portal. Um, Tupperware sounds like the plan. Where do I get started? Like I just said, Tupperware.com backslash Jordan.htm. Um, please put a shoe on your head. Do you plan on addressing the couch situation next week? I don't know. Maybe. How would one go about watching Everything's Fine Tonight? Great question. So uh, if you go to Everything's Fine Tonight Live's Facebook page um, uh, before 8 p.m. next Saturday, bing, bang, boom, you're in biz. Will there be Tup at EFTL? There might be. 
Are the lids and drum instructions included? Yes. It slurps up back? Yes. Um, Cups up. Don't say that ever. It slurps up. Uh, give me one sec. Look at this. Oh, wait. Is this cooler? There it is. I did it, okay? I did it. Can't wait to get some of that Tupperware in my cabinet and eventually my dishwasher. You know, I don't even have a dishwasher, Aaron, so you are blessed and uh, blessed. <laughs> um, a lot of people bummed right now. There was no couch. Yeah, I think you're the only one bummed about the couch sale, Liam. <laughs> but look, I put a thing on my head, so there you go, bud. Uh, that one's for you. I hope you feel better uh, about stuff. This is a miracle shoe. Um, uh, not Tupperware, just so people know. Ah. Um, cool. Well, folks, again, just go to Tupperware.com backslash Jordan is selling Tupperware to you dot HTM. And make sure to watch Everything's Fine Tonight live. We are coming back for the first time in four months uh, next Saturday. Uh, it's going to be fun. Uh, there's no couch, okay? No couches for sale, just Tupperware. And uh, a lot of people bum still. Yeah, that's great. No one, I never said this is a couch. In fact, all of the advertisements for this was were mentioning Tupperware, okay? So again, I got everyone's name written down for the poll that I'll be doing um, later today. And if you win the poll, I will contact you and we will get you some Tupperware. So thanks again, everybody, for watching. I really appreciate it. I hope you all stay safe and healthy. And I hope you all have a fantastic Passover and or Easter. And everything's fine. Thanks, guys. Love you so much. Buy Tupperware um, ASAP. And uh, thanks so much. How do I fucking end this?